A special mention to the marketing team. Because I think it's nice to see like the love brand coming to life, like in ways that it hasn't before. Just even just through imagery, the photos, just even those fun little things that capture everything on a daily basis. So I think I love seeing those. And on the back yeah. of that then to the, just see the new office, just getting new stuff for all those events that we've been having. So I think that's something we could be thinking of all the time, of what other ones that we could be using, not just for like Steve and Bill, but for like anyone in here thinking about things that we should do. You can all interact with me, that's all right. <laughs> <laughs> that's better, jeez, oh, Louise. <laughs> that's a great idea. Um, so we're gonna run through, welcome to Love Ignition, um, to a mon Monday morning pump up. Um, we're gonna run through just, that was the week that was that we all just saw. And um, we're gonna run straight into um, March, which has come along really quickly. Um, I chatted to a few people last week and um, I just wanted to give special mention to the property management team. Um, just for again, they've been crushing it. There's only a few many, not many faces at the moment. Um, but I threw some things out there. Nicole come back to, with me that, because property manager smarts on the 25th, they'd already leased 19 properties by last Thursday, which is great. Where are we up to now? 24. <laughs> and the other big things that they talked about, the repairs down to 1.4 days or at 1.4 days for repairs to be done which i think was awesome where it is are they ladies here um, shall we i think we got for that mm -hmm. and applications time is is 48 hours i thought that was pretty good so as far as it being on standard that's awesome well done for everyone we're going to look at you because you're just looking at me <laughs> <laughs> Um, sales team, I think helped 66 people just last month move, which I think was pretty good. Yep. Yeah. And we've set some targets to do better than that this month. So, um, love ignition. Everyone put their votes in, which was good to see. Um, some of the things I wrote down there for the people that we're going to call out. Um, and these, love ignition for everyone. Um, so we have our company values. And everyone that's voted every month, just the living vibe. Um, so for going above and beyond, um, for always being ready to help, and um, always showing the values. And she's not here, little Miss Zoe. Yeah. And Christy as well. Um, we've got a big, big team, and it takes a lot to keep everyone moving along. So I think our administration team all need a big round of applause. <laughs> we're, we're out running through on the cold face, they just keep everything moving along, and um, without much recognition apart from this. So thank you, ladies, and thank you, everyone. Come on, Cleef and clap at me. <laughs> <laughs> and just, I just want to mention too, just as far as like every week. Um, we talk about how we do step outside the norm and just break stereotypes. It's what we try to do every day. And um, I just we're getting everyone to contribute a little bit and just some things that happened last week. So anyone that come across any of the step breaking stereotypes? Um, we were, a week ago, we were due for settlement for a property in, um, in Cartier. Yes. And um, we, had a, we had some lovely owners that wanted to definitely settle on, on time this time because they've already been pushed back. So this time they really wanted to get that done. Um, but when we turned up for the final, the house was still pretty much full of stuff and so was the yard. And um, the buyers really wanted to move in as well. So we're all there together and we were like, well, what do we do now? Because we're probably going to have to push it back maybe over the weekend. Um, so I got my tie off, got my landing off and we, for two, two and a half hours we, um, Got all the stuff moved out of the house so the buyers could move in and the owners could move on. Yep. Awesome. That's great. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. That's it. That's well done. Yeah. 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 Just, a bit, just from chatting to people throughout the week, like a few things that people keep mentioning are just, like, just doing the normal things, taking the extra little bit of time um, to just stop and help people. Um, just everyone's busy and it takes, it's a big thing just to stop. Yeah. and help people just in um, normal day-to-day -day society. We just sort of play that forward. That's something that we all, we all do, um, but people do take notice to that. Um, something that we don't do, which I'll talk about, is Steve and Kate. 
they're, at the moment they're out um, riding 500 kilometres of through Thailand and um, I just wanted to talk about that a little bit because it's not that actually they've got out there, uh, they're raising money for children in need and um, they're really putting their, all the pedal to the metal, aren't they? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so it, it, we're gonna be, we'll be posting some videos throughout the week and showing everyone their progress um, but that's a really, really good cause that we're going to ask people just to, to watch, to engage in it, and if they can, um, donate to that, because it would be, you know, for true, it's really for the kids out there that have absolutely nothing, and we're, they're doing their little bit to make sure that they can just add to their lives.